This is class 30 of my arithmetic course. Today we're going to take test number 3. As you can see we have the test here. Be sure to follow the directions on the test. Be sure to write a title, your name, the date, and the course title. Number each problem, circle the number, rewrite the problem, show all work, and so on and so forth. Here's all the uh, directions. Be sure to follow all those. As usual, there's 25 problems, and each problem is worth 4 points for a total of 100 points. So get a screenshot of this page. And get a screenshot of this page, or these pages. The test should take you between 1 and 2 hours. When you take the test, be sure that all your uh, books are closed and you're not uh, on the internet. You should have a piece of paper and a pencil and your test in front of you and that's it. You need to be able to pass this test without any outside help or else uh, you're not really proving your uh, you're not really proving that you can uh, or that you've learned the material. So go ahead and take the test and pause the video and when you're done start the video and we'll talk about how to grade the test and I'll also give you the answers. All right, we're back. So you should be done with the test. And let's talk about how to grade the test. Um, this is all stuff that, you've already, that we already went over for test number two and test number one. Uh, subtract one point if you didn't write your name at the upper right corner of your paper. Subtract one point if you didn't write the date, so on and so forth. So just follow these rules to grade your paper. And uh, here are the answers. Let's go ahead and take a screenshot of that. And um, if you scored a 90 to 100, that means you know the material really well. An 80 to an 89 means that you know the mater material pretty well. If you scored a 70 to a 79, that means you know the material, but you have some issues that you need to work on. And if you scored lower than a 70, that means you don't know the material. And uh, most likely, you just didn't study for the test. So uh, hopefully d you did well on the test. And remember, this: these tests are your opportunity to prove that you know this material. If you don't score well on these tests, all that proves is that you really don't know the material and you're just wasting your time. So uh, hopefully you did well. And uh, if you pass the test, you're now ready to go on to uh, class 25. Or if you already finished uh, class 25 through uh, 28, you'll go on to uh, class 31 to uh, take the, uh, or to review for test number four. So again, sorry for the confusion going back and forth there, but uh, I look forward to seeing you in either Class 25 or uh, Class 31.